So what I'm going to do, I'm, I'm going to register a new table in the Orion target data. I right click on the Orion target data. I said, go to new, go to table. Yes. Now I will create a new table called product dimension. If I want, if you want, we can, I can give a description. Then I go to next. I say it is a base SAS. I need to say in which library it is going to reside. So I assign, I assign target tables library. Uh, one thing interesting you may see here while giving a metadata name, the name was DIFT space product space dimension. And here you can see while giving the names because SAS do not accept spaces. So it has it has by itself written underscores in the place of spaces. Then I go say next. Now I want to now it says select columns. And it has provided me some uh, the complete folder and I will choose columns from these from the existing tables. So I take the product ID, product name, supplier name, supplier ID. So I chose these three columns from the product list. And if you see there's a difference, first one coming with a circle in blue and the second one is coming as triangle with red. That means first one is a numeric kind of variable and the second one is character variable. Then I will choose some of it from supplier. I will choose supplier name and country. I'll You can also use this click. So five columns I have taken. Whatever attributes were present in product list and the supplier information, the same attributes will be copied to the new table. So these five columns are here. Suppose I want some more columns. There's the option of creating with, I say new. I say give me some more column like product category then I can change the length I can say it's of 25 and then it's character type and I just if I want to make this column at the end I can just pull it down and then I will make it put column number 7. I will create some more column. Product group. Description is not mandatory but as a practice I am writing it product line in description spaces are allowed so this is my if you want you can give the format in format as well as of now I'm not giving it I can define some indexes on this table so I say define indexes sorry I need to delete this. I will create an index on product ID. 
Okay, I need to create an index first. ID and then I will pull it here. Then I say another index and then I say suppose product group. So you can see I have created an index on this table. It is a practice when you are creating a index of a single column then you should give the column name as index name. If you want to say unique values, missing or missing value, all you all things you can define here. I'm done now, so I'm saying okay. Then I say next finish, and this new table will be created. So this is how we create a new table and it will be available in the checkout folder.